Hello guys, welcome to this video. Welcome. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how you can add a TST record on your website to verify your domain name. So in order to verify your domain name, like when you have created a Google account and the Google Search Console, you want to know the traffic that come to your website. Hence, Google Search Console need to verify your ownership. So after doing that, they will give you one code that you should need to add to the DNS record of your website so that they can be able to verify that you are the owner of that domain. So if you look my screen right here, they say that you should verify domain ownership via DNS record. DNS simply means domain name server. So you need to log into your domain registrar before you can add this code to that place. Here you can see this racalservices.com. I'm going to use another one. It's one of my clients' websites. I, ha I have many clients, as you know. So this one we are seeing right here is in the website of one of my clients, Rehad. Rehadglobal.com is one of my clients' website. So this website I hosted it on my website as an add-on domain. So the did not buy hosting but they bought domain name from other company which is this company opalic.ng this is rehardglobal.com rehardglobal.com we bought it from opalink.ng and i hosted it on my mailchimp web hosting as an add-on domain you can watch other of my videos on this youtube channel by clicking the description of this video so that you can watch that video on how to add an add-on domain to your web hosting so you do not need to buy web hosting from any company you buy domain name and you go to the to your web hosting account via cpanel and add it to the i explain it in that video in vividly so and importantly I do not use my MailChimp SSL certificate. So I went to Cloudflare to use their SSL certificate. So you can watch also one of my videos on this channel where I explain how you can connect your website to Cloudflare so that you can enjoy free SSL certificates and other features. Because MailChimp, they will give you free SSL certificate offer for one year. After that one year, you need to buy their premium SSL certificate. But if you are using Cloudflare, SSL certificate is forever. You don't need to buy any SSL certificate from them. That is why I recommend you to use Cloudflare SSL certificate. I created the video about it. Just open the description of this video. I promise you that I will add the link there. So this thing had. I used their name. I. Uh, I used Cloudflare to bypass the feature of using a name ship SSL certificate. So as I don't as I do not use MailChimp SSL certificate anymore, I can't add this TST code on my website DNS record. So what I should do is I will log into the Cloudflare accounts like right here. This is the Cloudflare account and I will go to record. First of all, create a Cloudflare account first and you click DNS. Then after you have reached that place, click add record. So uh, record type is TST. So I'm going to select TST here, TXT and you can name it here like domain verification so and the, here is the content the content means this code this code they refer to as content as you click copy so go to that website and you click paste so this is how to do it this code belongs to that website after you have done that, you click save. 
but note that it's going to take not less than 24 hours before they can verify your domain name you can see this is their comments dns changes may take some time to apply so if search console doesn't find the record immediately wait a day and then try to verify again so you need to wait for at least 24 hours before you can get started after you have added this code to this place and you click save the code is here already you click save so and you come back to your search console and you click verify they are going to tell us that it does not they can't see it for now because you just added that code to your dns record hence they have not seen it yet so that is how to add a tst record on your website via cloudflare so let us go to your nameship maybe you are using nameship ssl certificates you haven't connected the website to cloudflare yet so to do that one you go to your nameship account after you have logged in you click on the main list then you click advanced dns after that one you will see one option here and if you click here like this you turn it on you can select tst record from here after i have selected tst record from there you go to the you come here like this and you copy this code then you come there right here and you paste it after i have done that you don't need to change anything automatically nameship will start crawling your website to verify new dns code that you add to your domain record after some time like some days at least 24 hours maximum they start they will notice the that code that you just added on your website that is how you can add a tst record on your website for verifying your domain name on google shares console another way that you can add a tst record on your website in order to verify your domain name via google search console is to log into your cpanel web hosting cpanel like here and you navigate or scroll to zone a little you go to domain domain first is the domain section and you click zone editor So these are the domain names that we have on our web hosting presently. We have fastnow.com as the primary domain. Nameship is the one that hosts this web hosting for this website. And they are hosting this for Rehard Global. But the domain register of RehardGlobal.com is different. But while the domain name register and hosting provider for fastnow.com is Nameship. So I will simply if that uh, Rakal services does come, which they say that we should verify our domain name via the DNS record is here. If this website is is in our web hosting, I'll simply click manage. For example, if that website is like this, or this one, like I'll say it, manage. So this is where you can create it. You add a record by clicking add a record here then you have option to choose the record type the record type for here is tst record type is tst you can change it to any record type but you can you cannot change it to any record type here they provided a tst for you so i'm going to go here and i'll select tst so this is the test content add string to record so i'll simply go here i will copy it then come back here and we paste it so that is how to add the tst record so let me name it like this 
like the moon main v as the main verification and i'm going to click save if it is required time section time in second okay i'm going to click uh, add 120 that is two minutes i'll click save record you can see please keep in mind that the changes to dns record will require some time to propagate through the network it usually takes about 30 minutes the reason why we need to change the dns record of rehardglobal.com here via cloudflare is that i bought its domain from this website upper link and you can see our name server is not using nameship and it's not using upper link we are using a cloudflare name server see this is the cloudflare name server cloudflare.com name server one name server two name server three so if we come to here like this you can see this is our cloudflare name server the cloudflare give us name server so and you go here like this to your hosting or to your domain provider and you add it here you click change server you will then go back to your web hosting so i'm going to click dashboard so you can see rehabglobal.com domain is with another registrar it's with another registrar so you click manage You cannot change anything like it name server you are not changing because nameship does not give you name server it is the domain name that your domain name register the one that give you name server so i'm going to go to the main list i'll go to fastnow.com this is it if i click manage i can be able to change my name server so this is the call but i'm using custom name server which is which is cloudflare name server because i do not want to buy their ssl certificate this is the custom dns custom domain name server they have nameship basic dns nameship web hosting dns and custom name server so i choose to use custom name server which is cloudflare if you can see this is the cloudflare kit.ns.cloudflare.com that is the name server one that is the name server two if you want to add more name server you click add name server so you will continue like that so that's how you can add a tst record on your website i hope this video has vividly explained to you everything you need to know about adding a tst record on your domain for google search console verification comments with any challenge you may have to ask via the comment section